Hey everyone, it's V. Welcome back to my channel. I was gone for like a month and I didn't really film anything specific over that period of time. We're basically back in lockdown here and uh, I don't know what to do with myself. School's online, that sucks. Anyway, I got back on Tuesday after my flight was delayed three hours. I was sitting on that plane for five hours for a flight that's an hour and 45 minutes, so that kind of sucked. I ended up getting home at like nine instead of six, so yeah. But today's day three. I didn't film yesterday because I had schoolwork to do and a class and stuff, but I'm gonna go ahead and take a second COVID test. I honestly think I'm fine, but you never know. I'm gonna sneeze. And once again, I have evaded Rona. Okay, I have class in like an hour. So I'm gonna do my homework for that because I uh, definitely did not go to class on Tuesday because I was stuck on a plane. I also haven't been outside in two days. So I'm gonna do that later after class. Yeah, honestly though, I was like, I don't really know what I wanna film. Do I really wanna vlog like this whole week, even though it's, Thursday, but then as soon as I started filming, I was like, yeah, this is comfortable. <laughs> filming is comfortable and it gives me something to do throughout the week when I don't know what else to do. Hopefully I will have some fun things to do. I don't have classes on Fridays, but, but of course tomorrow, awful snowstorm, so I can't even go do anything. I don't know, we'll just see what happens. This, this is kind of my channel in a nutshell. You never know what's gonna happen. I just finished filming for another video that I'm doing. Um, yesterday, I ended up having a work thing that I forgot about. So I was in Zoom meetings slash Teams meetings the whole day. But I did end up going grocery shopping, which is good because the weather is abysmal. So I have no classes on Fridays, which means I should be doing homework. But instead, I'm watching the European Figure Skating Championships because it's now the last group and my favorite skater in this competition is going very shortly. But yeah, after that, I do have to catch up on my one class that does not have synchronous lectures because obviously I'm behind on those because if there's no lectures to go to, I just kind of forget that it exists. So I'm gonna look at that. I have an assignment due on Sunday. And then we have our first Discord anime club meeting of the semester tonight. Um, we did just get an email that we are still going ahead with starting classes in person on the 31st. So I'm hoping that's true because I hate online school so much. I am suffering so much right now. <laughs> Anyways, this is what I'm gonna do right now before doing homework. And then we're gonna have a cozy night. Hopefully not lose power, but we'll see. <laughs> Fun. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so I'm just looking at my first assignment for my environmental economics class and it's really just reading a paper and summarizing it. I'm gonna read it, take some notes, and then uh, we have our anime club stream at five, which is in 30 minutes. Um, a little summary about the European Figure Skating Championships, the guy who is my favorite, he got third place and I'm very, very happy for him. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this rooting. You ever just eat salad out of a mixing bowl because you don't have bowls big enough for your salad? I think you're good. When this has more issues than Zoom. So the storm has really picked up now. You can't even see me. I lost power. I don't know if you can hear the wind, but it's pretty terrifying. I was like, oh, I'm not gonna lose power. I never do, I'll be fine. Yeah, here we are. It's not even that snowy yet, but yeah, wind's really bad, so. Um, yeah, good times. I put on a bunch of layers because obviously it's cold out. I was like literally trying to sleep anyways. And then I was like, why did it get so dark all of a sudden? Because the, the lights across the street went out. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna keep trying to sleep, I guess, and hope that I don't freeze to death. 
I'm actually gonna go out and see people today. I'm going skating with a couple of my friends. So I decided I'm gonna wear some makeup today. While I did this, I just wanted to talk a little bit because I've been feeling very unmotivated these past few days. Like, it's really hard for me to get out of bed. And like, I think since I got back, like after one month of just being surrounded by people, pretty much like seeing people every day, talking every day, and then coming back to basically isolation has been really hard for me i didn't think it would be because i typically am very happy like living by myself but for some reason this time i just i feel it which sucks and obviously now with school well school hopefully being in person um in the next couple of weeks that'll be nice but yeah it kind of just sucks to, like go from like one extreme to the other <sighs> I think the number one thing is to like keep myself busy and to keep myself doing things and I think that's why I like filming so much especially since I kind of picked up filming during the pandemic one thing that I've started to do is to like set little goals for myself so like one of mine right now is waking up before 11 a.m which I've just been slowly working on it's been very difficult but I'm getting there very small thing but i'm very proud of myself for having gotten out of bed at a decent time today trying to be a little bit active every day as well just little things like that help me do things throughout the day when normally i wouldn't have the motivation to do things so um, that's been helpful and then obviously like getting some chances to see my friends is great as well which obviously some people probably don't have that luxury right now depending on where you live um where was i going with that yeah i just wanted to share that like my life isn't exciting all of the time if you're struggling right now due to the pandemic, due to anything, you're not alone. I'm with you there. It's mainly what I wanted to say. <laughs> I'm going to try to wear fake eyelashes today because I got new ones for the first time in forever and they're very cute. So I'm going to finish doing all my makeup and then we will see if I can put fake eyelashes on or not. Um, also exciting, I ordered some hair dye today so I can finally dye my hair. Okay, the makeup is done. Now let's see if I can put on fake eyelashes. But look at these. There you go. They're so pretty. I'm gonna see what I can do here. So I was actually successful in putting these on. I think they're pretty fun. Yeah, I like to be kind of annoying with my makeup when I do wear makeup. So I don't need to leave for like another hour and a half. So I'm gonna finish up an assignment before I leave and then uh, we'll be going skating. home and I ordered uber eats and it took an hour and a half to get here I'm so hungry right now there was a buy one get one free promo so I got enough sushi to last me two days and I also got some sesame balls because they're my favorite thing in the entire world Wednesday, January 25th, 1024. Uh, sure, that works. Yep, so that's gone through. We sent you an email with the confirmation. and. Okay, perfect. Okay, take care. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. Booked my booster. Heck yeah, I was only on hold for 38 minutes. It's not too bad. <laughs> Hello. I spent the most of the day cleaning my kitchen lovely and i've been back for like two weeks now have i no one week only one week oh my gosh i was like where has the time gone and i still haven't unpacked my stuff so i'm gonna unpack my suitcases i already started sorting like my clothes to know where to put it i did laundry before i left but this is the current disaster i have another class in a little bit so I'm hoping I can finish all of this. I also have some homework to do. This is what I like to call procrastinating. 
which I do a lot. It's like I never want to clean except for when I'm procrastinating. So I'll be back when all of this is put away and you can see the satisfying, clean living room and hopefully my room too. So I made some progress. Still need to take my Christmas tree down though. <laughs> but I think that is a job for another day. That has been today. I'm really hoping my hair dye comes in tomorrow so I can dye my hair. But I also have two quizzes to do tomorrow, so we'll see. But fingers crossed for that. Hello, everyone. While I was taking a bath, uh, the Amazon lady called me. So this, as I hoped, is my hair dye. And I realize now that I forgot to buy gloves or something to dye my hair with. So I'm just going to have purple hands for a bit. So I got two of the small bottles since I'm dyeing less than half my hair. I'm gonna mix these. I also got the Arctic Fox Diluter when I was out the other day. I also got a dyeing brush since this is my first time ever dyeing my hair an unnatural color. So I'm gonna blow dry my hair and then we will dye my hair. This is exciting. Welcome to my bathroom. I don't think we've been in here for a while. Um, I went ahead and sectioned off my hair off camera because this took me 30 minutes to do and I still have some dark pieces mixed with the blonde, but honestly that's not really my biggest concern. I'd rather have like dark pieces in the blonde that aren't gonna pick up the pigment anyways than missing blonde pieces and then having kind of yellow pieces in with um, my hair color. I have class in 15 minutes, so I have that ready to go. <laughs> I'm gonna be using a mixture of Girls Night and Periwinkle. And then I also have the diluter as well. All right, so here's my dye. That's a pretty good view of the color. I'm just brushing my hair out first. And you can see especially in the back, how much I miss, but it's so hard to section your own hair. Let's start. I should be using a mirror for this, but here we go. My childhood dream is coming true. Dyeing your hair on a budget, more like, I didn't really get the top part. Or like dyeing your hair when you're unprepared. <laughs> so we did 10 minutes of heat onto the uh, plastic. It's pretty warm. I'm gonna like go, I guess, maybe pay attention to class and then come back and rinse it out in the sink. It has been about two hours since I put this in. All right, so I finished more or less rinsing the color out of my hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry it. I think I missed like, a little bit in the back. We'll see what happens when I dry my hair. Well, it's definitely interesting. <laughs> it looks like I dyed my own hair, which oh, I did. It's, oh my gosh. Well, you can tell where the different levels of my hair were, that's for sure. I don't hate it. Um, I think I have to like put all of my hair down and then like see how it looks. I will go write my quiz, straighten all of my hair, and then come back and show you what it looks like. I just finished up doing my homework and I before that I straightened my hair. So now we can kind of get the better view of what my hair looks like. I don't hate it. It definitely could be better. Um, it's also very hard to tell what it actually looks like in this lighting. I'll take some pictures or like a clip tomorrow morning in natural lighting so you can see what it looks like and I'll put it right here. Hopefully it looks better because even I don't really know what it looks like right now. It looks a lot more blue on camera. Anyways, I think for a first try, it's not too bad. Also, like, I couldn't see what I was doing, so I really think I should have had someone help me. Maybe next time I'll ask Susie to help me. <laughs> the upper part here took a lot better, like, especially right here you can see, because last time I got my roots done, they were about that long. So that's, like, that's my virgin hair bleached, whereas this part was bleached three times on from box dye, so I think that's why I have, like, 
a bunch of color variants too because of how my hair was lifted but yeah i think overall for a first try it's not too bad it is like i'd say only mildly a fail but yeah i like it i think it's fun but yes um i think this will be the end of this very mundane vlog I have filmed since last Wednesday and I don't even remember what I filmed because I feel like nothing has been very exciting. I have a couple of video ideas planned. If there's any videos you want to see from me, feel free to leave them down in the comments for me and I would love to do those. But yes, um, I'm rambling so as always, thank you so so much for watching. I appreciate all of you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it could bring you a little happiness or a little comfort and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.